Then get up, get dressed Before it works off my list What's left to do, just guess Alright guys, are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, let's get into it Alright guys, are y'all ready? Guys, I have been wanting to bring this video to you guys for a minute And uh, today I am ready to show you all the products that I have and uh, I am going to tell you which ones I am going to keep and which ones I am going to get rid of, okay? Now, guys, y'all know that basically we do product reviews on this channel. We're trying to see what products make our hair grow, which ones is, you know, not doing so well, did nothing, did something, uh, which ones I like, which ones I don't like, right? So I am very excited about this video, guys. So it's not going to be in no particular order. But uh, let's just get into it. All right, guys, here is my container of my products, okay? So y'all know that I have been doing the healthy hair routine. And with doing the healthy hair routine plus taking my supplements, my hair has been grown. Um, so we are going to show you what I have been doing. Now, don't get me wrong. When we started doing our healthy hair routine, our hair has been growing. It has just been growing crazy. I said, well, I know if I start taking back my supplements, you know, my vitamins, will that help the boost? And it helped. It helped the boost. It accelerated my hair growth. I told y'all just last month, I cut my hair like six times. This month, I have already cut my hair like four times. And then I said, you know what? Since it want to grow so fast, I'm just going to let it keep growing. I'm just not going to let it grow over my ears or down my neck. I'm going to keep all of this lined and around my ears lined. But everything up in here, you know, I'm going to let it grow. Because it's growing really fast and I just want to see where it's going to go. Okay, like I said, this is not going to be in any particular order. I am just going to grab them. Aloe vera juice. Aloe vera juice has a lot of things that will help your hair grow and get strong. Um, I put my aloe vera juice in a spray bottle. When y'all see me doing my healthy hair routine or in the morning when I'm about to style my hair, this is what's in here. Aloe vera juice is what's in here. And um, when you use the aloe vera juice and you want to put it in the bottle, put it back in the refrigerator. Once you open it, put it back in the refrigerator and keep it in a dark spot. So I'm just saying, put it back in the refrigerator because you know, the light go off once you put it in the refrigerator, but it must go back in the refrigerator. So aloe vera juice is a yes. Okay. This is canned to coconut milk, detangling and conditioning leave in conditioner. This is also a yes. And I got to get some more because this is empty. It's empty, but this is a yes. It's like white in there. I love this. I love this. Guys, you know, it's always good to have a leave-in conditioner for your hair. This one right here makes the cut for your girl. And you can also use this just like I did as a spritzer. If you want to refresh your curls, this is one thing that you can use. And it's a leave-in detangling conditioner, and I love it. I really like using this also when I rinse my hair, like when I color my hair. If I don't want to put a cream conditioner on my rinse, because rinses are semi-permanent, and I don't want to put a cream conditioner on there, then have to wash it out again because rinses only come with so many washes. So I will put a leave-in conditioner on my hair, especially when I'm using a rinse. This is a yes. Okay. Snap back snapback guys i used to use snapback by carefree curl and i absolutely loved it but this right here by star care this is a no for me you may be able to use it but i don't know if i'm allergic to it or what but when i use this i tried to use it three to four different times i tried to wash my hair and you know put it on clean 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 hair and each time I itch profusely. Now, for you, it may not do that to you. But for me, it was it was terrible for me. 
So for me, let me see if I can get y'all to see it. It didn't even do what my old, it's, it's pink. Can you see that? It's pink, it's thick. It's almost like a jelly. This is a most definite no. I'm gonna put this way over here. That is a no. Um, I can either give that away to someone and tell them what it did to my head or for like my curly ponytail since it ain't gonna be on my scalp. Um, I use it as a curly ponytail if I ever want to do a curly ponytail or a curly wig and I'll use that up on that, but it'll never go back on my head. I I'm good. I'm good. Mm -mm. Got to be glue. Guys, I use this a lot. I, I use this a lot. I mean, I got some in my car. I keep some in every room and that's because I use this on basically my hair. I use it on my brows. If I want my brows to look laminated, this controls my flyaways, especially when I was having my slick downs. Um, I don't wear wigs anymore. and um, But when I did wear wigs, this is what I used, you know, either the spray or this to you know hold my wigs down but I use this basically on my flyaways when I was fading my hair in the back to hold it down and on my eyebrows so yes I like this product I do so we're gonna put that with the yes okay so we got two of those we gotta put that with the yes now guys let's get to the next one next one Nairobi this is a yes. Y'all know that this is a styling foam. And even though I have a texturize and even though I have natural hair, I use Nairobi to, you know, uh, put my hair in place. Last time that I did the slick down pixie and um, I put this on my hair, it made my hair stay soft. And uh, I really liked it. It made me feel like I could wave my hair, you know, with this. Um, so this is a yes. Do y'all remember uh, like my ending? My outros for my videos and I'm underneath the dryer and I come from underneath the dryer and I'd be like yes that's what I used on my hair I used this on my hair Nairobi and echo style and gel so this is a yes okay now guys I don't know if y'all know about this I don't know if y'all have this but this here let me see if I can tilt it. This has three rows in it. Let's see. Can you see that? Maybe now you can see it. It has three rows in it. This is a three-row demi-cone. This is everything. This is everything. I got it from Sally's. It was like $3.49. But guys, this is just like the demi brush, but it's the demi cone. And guys, this is everything. This is my go-to. This is my go-to. So this is a yes. Got that at Sally's. When I had my texturizer, I love Snapback, right? I loved it. But they discontinued it and I couldn't find it anywhere. So in my hair journey, you know, I want it to be simple, easy. I, I want to remain having my hair sexy, soft, glowing, moisturized. I want to take care of my hair. And uh, I went on a journey to try to find some type of carefree curl, you know, product and uh, I was only able to find this and this is carefree curl instant moisturizer well this is carefree curl gold instant activator and guys I'm telling you I'm using it on my hair it's a dual conditioning for uh, natural and curly you know hair and I'm telling you y'all gonna see me using this a lot I used it on my hair today guys my hair is so soft. It's just, it's what's up. It is what's up. And um, I used this and another product in my flicking video. I said, don't curl it, don't slick it, flick it. And this is one of the products that I use. So guys, I like this so much that I got. And when I find it again, I am gonna go get some more because they, they discontinued. So I'm gonna find as much as I can and I'm a bad up. So this is a yes. So we're gonna put this over here with the yeses. Okay. Um, this. Guys, I will never, I will never stop using this. Just, just, 
I'm, I'm, I'm not going to stop using it. This is a wave whip curling mousse. Now, if you go through my videos and you see me waving my hair, this is one of the things that I wave with my hair with my favorite gel. And this is a can to wave, you know, wave whip curling mousse. Okay. Now I use this on my hair and it's for natural hair. It's for curls, 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 coils, and waves. And uh, it's lightweight, it moisture and conditions. So it moisturizes and conditions. So I like this, guys. This is a Cantu Wave Whip uh, Curling Mousse for natural hair. It's for curls, coils, and waves. It's lightweight and it moisturizes and conditions. This is a yes all day long. So this is Sister Girl Yes. And this is by Cantu. So since this is the sister, let me show you the brother. This is the brother. <laughs> This is Cantu. So this is a yes. This is a yes, guys. This is a yes. Now, this is Cantu Comeback Curl Next Day Curl Revitalizer. This did help me, guys. When I couldn't find the snapback anymore, this is my go-to. This is my go-to. This is a can this is by Cantu. Next day curl revitalizer. Now, guys, I don't play with this stuff. I don't play with this stuff. I don't run out of this stuff. You know, now if you see me with two of them or three of them, this is the bomb. I use this right along with the mousse. They both can too. Okay. Now, so that is a yes. The can too. With next day curl revitalizer. That's a yes. Now, guys, before I go any further, I want you to hit that like, share, subscribe, notification bell. And also keep in mind and leave anything in the comment section down below that I did not address in this video. And you guys already know that I'm I'm going to answer you back, right? Y'all already know I'm going to answer you back. So, now that we got that out the way, let's continue. All right. The next thing that I have, guys, is this. This is a Carefree Curl uh, Curl Activator. Okay. So I basically use this if I want, you know, something creamy on my hair and, you know, things of that nature. This is an activator and uh, this is an instant activator. So I guess this is two of the same, you know, um, but this is more of a lotion base. This is like gold and this is more like a cream base, but either or, either one you get is good. I like this one better, you know. But if I want to put like a cream, almost like a cream condition on my hair, I will use this. You know, I'm, I'm trying to use that up. Um, so that one is an in-between. If you want to buy that, it's fine. But um, basically, I'm, I'm leaning more towards this instant activator instead of this uh, curl activator. So that's why I am. So that's an in-between. That's a yes. You know, you don't have to. That's a maybe. Put it like that. But I like it. I like it. It did its job. The next thing we have is rosemary. Who don't like rosemary water? Okay. Now, this is also a maybe. If you want to just have a spritzer for your hair, you can have a spritzer for your hair. It's a strengthening mist. So if you have weak or sparse areas in your hair, okay, this will do it. And I told you guys that I have like a sparse area here, sparse area here, and between there. I did have that at one time, but with our daily healthy hair routine, my hair is growing, it's filling in and everything. And I also bought this for, you know, like if your hair is getting sparse around here, if you wear wigs or you have a tight style, you know, just brush your hair wherever you're thinning at. And this is rose water and it's a strengthening mist. Okay, let's say you're breaking your hair off from color and perms and texturizers or something like this. That's something that you can spray on your hair and, you know, and keep it moving. So I like this, but this is also a maybe, you know. It all depends on if you need it. Um, by my hair growing with everything else that I have, I'm not going to buy this again. And speaking of buy again, um, guys, everything that I'm showing you, I pay for with my own money. I'm not sponsored by any of these people. I'm not trying to sell you anything. I'm just clarifying for you guys 
the products that I use and uh, I don't want you to become overwhelmed uh, because of all the products that I have. I have collected this over time and uh, I'm showing you what I have collected that works. Now, what, whatever you want to put together that's going to be a good thing or a good mesh for your hair, cool. That's fine. Maybe you just want to get this, this, and a leave-in conditioner. Because for a while, guys, I only used these three, these three things plus my favorite gel, and it was perfect. It was perfect. I'm telling you, I, I had no worries. No worries. Okay, let's keep this going. Guys, I, this I love. This is a yes, hands down, all day long. I would never stop using this. I would never stop using this. This is Hawaiian Silk 14 and 1. These are the 14 things that it does. And I'm going to tell you right now, guys. I had two bottles, but I already used one up. And in another video that I showed you guys, I showed you how I had two bottles. Now, with this, it's real thick. Um, I should have kept that bottle because the empty bottle, I could have diluted it a little bit with water because it comes out real white. You see that? And guys, yeah. But it is a moisturizer. I love Hawaiian silk. I love Hawaiian silk. It's a miracle worker. That's what it says right here. Miracle worker. This is good all day long. So that is a yes, hands down. Yes, hands down. Okay. Let's keep it moving. This. This is also a leave-in conditioner, guys. This is a leave-in conditioner. This brand is really good. It's a pro-vitamin leave-in conditioner. This is uh, a yes or no. I wouldn't take it over, you know, my can too. Because, you know, no, this is cream of nature. Milk, you know. And there's nothing wrong with it. It's just that when I went out and I was on a whole new hair journey, I wanted something you know, a, a leave-in conditioner. I like this brand. So whether you want to go with this conditioner or this conditioner, no problem. No problem. Whatever one you pick is a good one. This was part of my daily healthy hair routine too, you know. And um, yeah, I like it. Uh, I like it. So this is a maybe because the one I would buy first is, you know, my cream of nature coconut milk. So that's the one I would buy first. So, so far, we only got a few things that's in the maybe. And one that's in the hell no, you know, for me. Disclaimer, that's just what it does on my hair. I, okay. So now we're going to keep it pushing. Now this, guys, I didn't have this for a minute. And I even labeled it. This is why I say this is a good product. This is a good product. So, you know, it's up to you which one you want to buy. This is like a reconstructor, but it's the same as this. It's just a reconstructor, and you use this after a perm. And I even labeled it, use it after a perm. And uh, it's the same line as this. Okay, so that's why I'm saying it's up to you which one you want to go with. Um, I usually, this has green tea in it and keratin, and it's a reconstructor. Now, when I was doing my texturizers, guys, to strip them back up my hair, I would spray my hair with this, you know, to make my texturizer. Since we just broke it down, we want to build it back up. So I used a reconstructor. A-P-H-O-G. Yeah. So this is a yes, especially if you're texturizing your hair or let's say you're coloring your hair or you're bleaching your hair, or, you know, perming your hair. This is a really good product to have, okay? So that's, you know, that's... Maybe, you know. I don't need it anymore because I haven't texturized my hair. I ain't thinking about texturizing my hair. And y'all know why. Right. All right, let's keep it moving. Another one of my favorite, guys. Another one of my favorites that's in my healthy hair routine. And 
basically I do this every day, but since I have found this, uh, this has been taking up my um, routine now. Um, but I, now instead of doing it every day, all because I have this right here, I will probably do this, what I'm gonna show you, maybe twice a week. Because my hair is moisturized, my scalp feel good, it's not itching anymore or anything like that. Maybe this product did its job. And once I moved on, you know, to this, it is what it is. Guys, I can't say enough about Suffer-Aid. And it's medicated too. I'm telling you guys, Suffer-Aid Original Formula. Oh my goodness, it's medicated um, hair and scalp conditioner. I, yes. If I ever run out of this, I'm going back and get this again. Okay? This is one of my favorite hair greases. Um, I tried Wild Grow and everything like that. I my I didn't see no big results with the itching or my hair growing. But this right here, yes, yes, yes. Now, the other thing that you can oil your hair with, guys, and it's one of my favorites because I use it in other places too. Believe it or not, I'm, I'm showing you all my secrets, is this vitamin E oil. And you see at the bottom where it says skin health. Well, once I had started using this and my, my scalp was just itching profusely. And I didn't want to just be scratching in my head like that. I mean, I started drying up all around my hairline and things of that nature. And I was like, what is going on? Not only do I use this to oil my neck and my skin because it's for skin health. I go around my eyes with it. Y'all have seen me go around my eyes in a reverse motion. You know, that's good for your eyes. And also, I will take this bottle, open it up, and I will grease my hair. I will grease my hair with this when I'm not using this. Both of these are good. Both of these are hell yes. So, whichever one you want to pick, you know, pick it. You know, so with everything that I'm showing you guys, yeah, just see what your hair needs out of everything that I'm showing you. And then you put together what, you know, combinations you want to put together, uh, you know, with this stuff. But I am telling you what works. Trust me. So what I'm showing you and then that vitamin oil, that vitamin E oil, man, keeps your hands soft, your skin soft. Man, come on, man. Come on. I, I won't stop, man. How about that? And I also, I say that for a different video because we're going to talk about another video shortly. So guys, also, I don't use this because I don't need this. It is just here. But when I was using it, I was using the hell out of it. And that is um, spritzer. You know, this is a, a liquid mousse, you know, spritz. Everybody know about this, you know. And uh, I don't use it anymore. It's by Fantasia. You know, why would I need to spritz my hair? So this is, uh, no, I won't be buying this anymore. But there's nothing wrong with it. You know, if you if your hair requires a hold, this is what will hold it. But I don't need it anymore because I don't wear those type of styles, you know, anymore to need that. So, no, I won't be buying that again. Then, guys, of course, you know when I was using... A texturizer you need something that's going to stop the action of that perm and this is just a neutralizing uh, shampoo you know and uh, conditioner you need something that's going to stop the action of that perm you never want to put a perm or a texturizer in your hair and just rinse it out you want to stop that action and remember I told you guys when you washing your hair at least wash your hair three times because if this is still pink while you washing your hair that means some perm is still in your hair. Some texturizer is still in your hair. Some type of chemical is still in your hair. Wash your hair until it turns white. And then you good. Then you can move on to your conditioner. Next, guys, is... You ready? The next thing I want to show you is Big Papa. Now, guys, I paid $12.99 for Big Papa. That's a lot for a little container. And uh, it's by Docs. And uh, it's a defining gel for all curl types. Now, I can actually tell you guys 
I do like Big Papa. I have been doing a series on Big Papa, mixing it with different things. And I'm telling you, it keeps getting better. It keeps getting better. You know, although it's really pricey to me, just for this $12.99, I would buy it again. I like how my curls act. I like everything that I have been mixing it with. And um, I'm telling you, like I said, with this and this, that was an 11. Mixing it with this and this, that is a straight 11. That's what's on my hair today. Um, and this towards the end of the day, guys. My hair is soft. It's curly. You know, mm -mm. this and this was a 10. Now, this and this gave me uh, taco meat. Remember, I did that um, part four, and I told you guys, are y'all ready for the taco meat? I believe it was this that I did it with. If I'm not mistaken, it was this and this. But um, just go back and look at the videos. I have labeled it Big Papa, Big Papa 1, Big Papa Part 2, Big Papa Part 3, Big Papa Part 4, Big Papa Part 5. And um, guys, I'm telling you, each time I, you know, use this towards, you know, 3, 4, and 5, they have been, you know, part 3, 4, and 5, they have been 10 and up. And like I said, today I have Big Papa in this. And when I put this on my hair, when I put Big Papa in this on my hair, that's what made me say, oh, crap. Let me go find as much as I can before they really discontinue this. So... Big Papa is a yes. Big Papa is a yes. So, guys, for the finale, the last thing that I have to show you. I saved the best for last. I saved the best for last. And I know it's the best because I have tried different ones. And nothing compares to this. This is never going to go anywhere. I will always purchase this last product. You ready? Ba -ba -da -da. Echo Styling Gel. And I reiterate to you guys, this is the best one for my hair. I'm telling you, when I first did the big chop and I was, you know, doing the corals and things like that, this is what curled up my hair. This is what grew my hair. I never had a problem with Echo Styling Gel. And the only reason why I tested different ones, I wanted to see was I missing out or limiting myself on something that could have been better. But once I went through them and tested them, no, this one right here, this one right here was good. Now, another one that was good but didn't touch this one was the Echo Styling Gel that's in the brown you know, have the brown top. I think they had coconut oil in it. But guys, I reiterate, when you go, you're going to see an Echo Styling Gel that looks like this. But make sure it has everything that's listed on the bottom there. It's for all hair types and it tells you what it does on the bottom. Uh, it is, um, it is, uh, water-based and, um, it has olive oil in it, and it repairs, conditions, defines, moisturizes, smooths, and shines. And it does all that to my hair. And I only buy it in this size. That's the reason, um, you know, I buy it in this size because it's so good, and it does everything it says it does, and it does grow my hair as well. Guys, that is it. That is it. The only thing that uh, I wouldn't buy again is this. It's because I didn't like it. Uh, this, the spritzer, Fantasia spritzer, because I don't need it. Uh, neutralizing shampoo. Won't buy that again because I don't, you know, uh, texturize my hair anymore. So I don't need that to shut off nothing. The maybes are... Rose water. It's good, but that's not something I'm going to run out and be just adamant about buying. Um, because, and this here. I don't really need this. If I run into it, if I run out of this, yeah, but I don't really need, you know, this. So this would be a maybe. I'm not, you know, that ain't nothing that's on the hit list. 
you know, a reconstructor for your hair is always good. But this is the one that I use after processing my hair. So I wouldn't need to go out and buy that. That's uh, A-P-H-O-G. Uh, so I wouldn't need to go buy that. And um, pretty much that's it. Look back through the video, guys, and you'll see everything that I decided to keep and everything that's my absolute favorites. Um, I told you when it comes down to leave-in conditioners, both of these are good, but I do prefer this one, you know, over this one. Nothing is wrong with it, but if I want to cut down on product use, this is a maybe. If I don't find this one, then I will get this one. But other than that, guys, um, that's pretty much it. That is pretty much it. Um, I hope this video has been helpful. All right, guys, when well, you have reached at It's Regina TV, those are all the products that I have in my arsenal. The one I love, the one I like, the one that's okay. You know, I don't really need to buy again. And uh, thank you for coming by spending this time with me, guys. You are the reason why my channel is growing. So don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share. Leave in the comment section down below anything that I did not address in this video that you want to know. So until next time, stay safe, stay blessed, love one another, and I'll talk to you later. Mwah. Then get up, get dressed Before it works off my legs